Today's lecture continues our series on vitamins with vitamin B5, also known as pantothenic acid. Now, pantothenic acid is a necessary constituent of coenzyme A synthesis. Now, CoA, as we know, is an important cofactor for acyl transfer reactions. So, uh, but pantothenic acid is a big player in a variety of actions that occur throughout our body as far as metabolism goes. It is also a necessary constituent of fatty acid synthesis. And it can be found in avocados, like I've drawn down there, eggs, meat, yogurt, and whole grain cereals. Now, a deficiency in vitamin B5 can lead to adrenal insufficiencies, dermatitis, enteritis, alopecia, and hepatic encephalopathy. Now the reason that there is such a wide range of pathologies associated with the deficiency of vitamin B5 is because the cofactors and the fatty acid synthase are um, necessary in a wide variety of metabolism reactions. So all of the pathologies associated are going to be spread throughout the entire body. There has been no uh, recorded excess of vitamin B5 other than the possibility of diarrhea from having too much in your system. This is a picture of the molecule of pantothenic acid and this is vitamin B5.